folks, how's everybody doing? This is Species 7, and welcome to the Feed the Beast Ultimate Pack. So this is a brand new spawn. This is where I landed. I haven't moved an inch. And, uh, well, I don't mind planes, although it's not really what I wanted. Let's go for a walk. So, all of the mods that yeah, it looks more like blocks than wood, but hey. All of the mods that come with this particular pack, I currently have enabled, including Greg Tech, etc., etc. Um, I suppose what I should have checked was to make sure I'm on normal mode and not uh, peaceful. I found for some reason occasionally when you load a new pack, it defaults to peaceful. I think on my first run at this version of Feed the Beast, not the Ultimate, but the uh, the first one I ran on the last play before I settled on an area, um, it was doing that as well. Hmm. Boy. Kind of a shortage of trees in this area, isn't there? Damn. That's not so good. Because... Uh, Trees are kind of a necessary thing. Well, it looks like we might have a little bit more going on. Um, I've been waiting for a while for the ultimate pack to come out. Um, I'm not going to abandon... Hmm. I'm not going to abandon my other Let's Play by any means. If... Um... Which is the Direwolf 20 pack. But I think we've gotten far enough in that pack that, uh, well, I guess there's a few trees. We've gotten far enough in that pack that, uh, I can probably do it on a more per episode basis. In other words, where, you know, rather than show you that, yeah, I'm breeding bees and I've now moved through the first five chains. Well, when I get a breed that does something useful, like makes uh, oil propolis, or can regenerate viz, or something like that, um, that's probably worth doing an episode. Um, is it worth doing another episode to go from, uh, you know, diligent to weary, or whatever the next step is? Maybe not. Um, Pretty much all of the different machinery that can be built has been built. Um, no, I'm not saying I built every piece of gear in the game. Um, you know, I would like to get into a little bit of, wow, that's cool. A little bit of, uh, I think I'm going to live here. That is trippy. Um, the force field stuff. MFFS or whatever the heck it's called, that is just trippy. Huh, I do like that. Hmm, <laughs> I do, I do. I think I might select this as our spot. Um, Acacia, well, that's what that was. Well, I think I'll go with spruce for now. Quickly throw up a crafting table. Oops. <laughs> nice crafting table, eh? Um, whereas I think starting with this one, um, the other thing being that you didn't really get to see me start in the last one at all when you get right down to it. Um, I'd spawned a world before I started doing the Let's Plays. And we sort of uh, picked up with a house with a bunch of reasonable gear. Definitely nothing special, but you know. Um, whereas here, as you can see, oh, I really shouldn't have bothered with that axe, because I'm not even going to probably use it, because I can make stone ones in about 35 seconds here. Um, let's, okay, how are we doing? Getting enough? Um... Yeah, so this this has an opportunity to be a more complete 
Let's Play. Um, I noticed that, uh, not that I get a lot of views anyway, I'm a fairly new YouTuber and I don't have a lot, uh, a lot to compare with a lot of the people that are out there. Although I will try and I will get better, I promise that. Um, there we go. And I think I'll build an axe as well. Told you I'd never even get to use it. <laughs> um, I mean, yeah, I will improve. Things will get better, but by the same token. Um, trying to compete with the other people that are doing uh, Let's Plays of Minecraft and stuff. It's, well, I don't suppose it's a competition to start with, but I'm, you know what I mean. Um, if you expect to get any views in a market as big as Minecraft, and if nobody's watching, there's really no point in doing it. Um, you know, I enjoy making the videos, but I enjoy making them because I enjoy logging in and looking and seeing that, wow, hey, you know, you've been at this for a month and you've had 400 views. That's not a lot. There's 50 billion people watching these things on other people's channels, but wow. This might not be a bad area, actually, you know. But, um, you know, I'm not one of the blessed few yet, that's for sure. Maybe someday I will be. You know, I'm definitely going to keep uh, upgrading my equipment and trying to keep my uh, banter up. I mean, years and years ago, I did work as a DJ in a radio station for a while, so I should be able to talk to people that aren't there. Or that I can't see. <laughs> I'm hoping they are there. <laughs> of course, I hope that on the radio, too. Yeah. Yeah, luckily enough, as it turned out, there actually was people listening. It amazed the hell out of me the first time I found that out. Yeah. So. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think I'll be camping here. It's, uh, it's interesting, but it really has no room for expansion of any kind. That's why I kind of like more mountainous areas. Probably could have lived out the night there, but... I really like that there's so many cows, because I know those are going to be handy. But other than that, man... How about this? I mean, it doesn't have to be a full-blown mountain, but no, that's going to be completely whoa, full of water. So let's go uphill a little bit and have a look. <laughs> uphill, there is no uphill. Okay, that's not mountains, that's piles of sand. Hmm. Oh, there's some reeds. Always good to grab some reeds when you find them. Because you may end up in an area that has none. And it doesn't take many to make some. So, there we go. Oh, five. Good enough. So I'd really like to get a little bit more of a hillier area. Definitely. Wow. It's just uh, a little plains biome that goes on forever. Yeah, I know I've already come this way, but hmm. I think I'm just gonna head for that bushier section there. Hopefully it's not a taiga biome, because that's my least favorite of all. And it is. Lovely. But, lots of wood. I know I'm not far from cows. And cows are always good to have. But I really don't want to... Well, I hear chickens too, eh? I don't want to rely on having to continuously build expanding outer structures. I really think I'm going to prefer to do this one. That when I need more room, it's just a matter of banging a little farther into whatever hill I'm on. Something like that. But again, I don't really want to be in a taiga biome. Simple reason being, it's very, very hard to farm in a taiga biome, because your bloody water freezes. So, uh, but what I do see is that the sun's going down, so I need to take shelter pretty quick. So, 
Let's see here. Yeah, definitely. We don't have long. It's going to be dark. Uh, huh. Well. Hee hee hee. Alright, I've only got minutes till the sun goes down, so I gotta dig a hole and cower down for the night. Oh, damn. That's not a hole, that's a grave. Whoa! Come on, don't make it that difficult. <laughs> that is a awful lot of really freaking deep pits here. Yeah, no? So I think, there we go, lovely, that'll be a good start, uh, there, cobblestone, gonna be dark pretty quick so yeah I think uh, we're gonna check out the ultimate ultimate mod pack and uh, see where that gets us hmm. well this would be a weird place Interesting. Has possibilities. Definitely has possibilities. So, first thing I want to do, of course, is build myself a little stove. So, let's put that down. Get ourselves a stove built. Da 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 da. Achievement. Hot topic. Yes, indeed. And let's get ourselves some charcoal, spruce wood plank, and acacia wood. Nice. <coughs> Excuse me. Oops. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. I know what I'm doing. Honest. Eh, not all of them. We don't need that many torches to start us off. In fact, this... Oh, come on. You could have at least burned all the way through that second piece. Yeah, it's not going to make this one anyway. There we go. Alrighty. Nice. Mm -hmm. Some sticks, please. Thank you. Nice. Look at that. And we have our first night's survival in hand. There we go. We will live. Perfect. And with that, folks, you know what we're up to here. Um, now, obviously, I mean, I will do things like mining and such off camera, but anything we build, anything we put together, any sort of improvements, that's all going to be done on screen. So with 90 mods, this could be a bit of a long Let's Play. I hope you're going to enjoy it. Uh, I know I will. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, Zyk, the least mostly released Zycraft sorry, is in this one. Uh, I've been waiting a while for that to be something other than pretty blocks. And like I say, I'm not abandoning the other one. But until I see it later, this has been Species 7. This is the ultimate pack for Feed the Beast. And ciao for now, folks. <laughs>